Hi there, this is Ranjit and in this uh, video I'll show you some of the basic tips that you can use if you have a Windows uh, 10 based laptop or a tablet. As you can see, this is my Windows uh, Surface Pro 4 and I have to say the battery life is sort of pretty average on this one. Uh, but I've been using these simple tips to enhance the battery life. And if you have Windows uh, 10, the first thing you need to do is go to the power option, just type power and go to this power and sleep settings that you get over here. And from here, just go to this uh, battery saver option. And uh, here it will give you the remaining battery life uh, if you're running on uh, battery. Just click this battery usage. And uh, this uh, will give you an idea during the past 24 hours, what is actually taking up the most battery. And if you go down, uh, it'll show you the apps uh, that uh, consume the most power. So this should give you an idea if there is any app uh, that is consuming way too much power, you can easily identify using uh, this one. Another thing you can do is, and I've already done that, is go to this option called change background app settings and just disable uh, uh, background apps for the app studio, uh, which you think are not very important. I've already disabled it for most of the apps that uh, I think are not very important. So if some of the apps that are not critical, just uh, switch off the background app settings. This can also save uh, quite a bit of uh, power. Uh, next thing is, uh, yeah, we have this, uh, what do you say, Cortana. And if you uh, do not use Cortana a lot, uh, I would suggest you just uh, shut it off. Uh, this won't impact the battery life by a huge margin, but I've noticed a uh, battery savings between one to 2% when you just switch this off. Uh, so I have, I generally don't use Cortana, so I have disabled that setting. So you can play around with that one also. Apart from that, uh, it's also a great idea to know uh, how what is the health of your actual battery on your laptop or a tablet. And for that, you can run the battery report health. I've already made a separate video regarding that. Link for that will be in the YouTube show notes. Uh, so you can check out that. Next, what you can do is uh, you can open up uh, the command prompt. Just go to this command prompt and uh, type in this uh, command that is power configuration command i'll have that on the screen power cfg minus device uh, query wake armed and when you enter this ideally it should say none and uh, if it's showing some apps uh, that uh, are being listed, that means those apps are actually waking up your device uh, from the sleep. So just make sure that it should be ideally be none or if it's a known app that uh, you have designed to wake up, uh, that's okay. But uh, as you can see right now, nothing, nothing is uh, running. Another thing that you can do is uh, you can go to Windows Update. By default, this is switched on. Just type update, it should come. Windows update settings. And here, uh, if you go to this advanced option, and here you see this option called choose how updates are delivered. Click this. By default, this will be switched on like this. And switch this off also. This also can help in battery life. Next, you can also do this uh, if you have a fast computer. For example, uh, instead of going to the standby mode all the time, uh, wouldn't it be great if it goes to hibernate after some time? And to do that, just enter power and uh, this will be uh, there and go to this additional power settings and this uh, will open your power profile uh, and just click this change plan and go to this advanced power settings over here. And from here, uh, just uh, click the sleep and hibernate after. By default, this will be a manufacturer setting amount. I have set it to 150 minutes. That's approximately two and a half hours. So if I don't use the Surface Pro 4 for about two and a half hours, it will go in the hibernate mode and not in the standby mode. So you can also play around with this one and uh, set it to a desired level. So that should also help. Another simple app that I use to determine the battery life is uh, this uh, app that is known as battery bar. As you can see, whenever you just hover over it or if you just click on it, it gives you an idea how much uh, uh, battery life is uh, left. For example, 51% and it says about, it'll run for about one hour, 18 minutes. 
so this is a free utility that I use and this also shows us the battery where notice the last column uh, so it's a good idea to install this app it's a free app for example you can just go to this battery bar pro this is the pro version i'm not using the pro version actually i'm just using this basic version so you can also install this uh, app and by that uh, you can easily know uh, the battery health and the number the actual percentage of battery life that is left because windows does a terrible job in estimating how much battery life is uh, sort of uh, left and what is the runtime that you might get so again these were some simple tips that i used to enhance the battery life on my windows 10 uh, computer specifically the uh, surface pro 4 so again do let me know if you found these simple tips uh, helpful again i also use a mac so do let me know if you like these kinds of videos i can also produce these kinds of feed videos every uh, couple of weeks or so again guys thanks for watching this uh, video this is ranjit and i hope to see you in my next video